Hi everybody, this is Jambo Staffy Bull Terrier Trick Dog and I'm Louise and we're here today because we're taking part in the Pet Professional Guild's International Day of Force Free Training to celebrate basically force free training and to take part in this event you need to actually spend 30 minutes um, demonstrating some force free training with your dog or taking part, you can even just go for a walk or a run but it's got to be force free. Uh, if you want to take part, go on over and have a look at the Pet Professional Guild's um, either website or their Facebook page and you'll find more information. And uh, what we've decided to do to get you involved is that we're going to teach you some tricks. So we're going to teach you how to teach your dogs some tricks. And we then hope that you will register for the event and actually do these tricks that you've learned with your dogs. So, I'm going to teach you some novice tricks and some intermediate tricks. I'm also going to give you some tips on marking and rewarding and on using positive reinforcement training. Now, when we talk about force free, this is all force free all the time, what we mean is that there's going to be no fear involved. There's going to be no physical manipulation of your dog. There's definitely not going to be any pain. There's going to be no prongs, no chokes, no e-collars. Okay, we are not going to be using any aversives. We're not going to intimidate our dogs in any way. Fourth three means just that, without force. So that is our little bib. I've put it on the back because I'm wearing this great t-shirt. You can also get the t-shirts when you sign up. So you can order a t-shirt from the Pet Professional Girl. If you take part, you're going to get a certificate saying that you've taken part. Um, you're also going to get a medal. And you are in the chance, in with the chance of winning some fabulous prizes. So this is definitely worth taking part in. Now, why do Jambo and I promote force free training or positive reinforcement training as we call it? Um, we are so involved with promoting it, mainly to be honest because of what breed Jambo is. We're very, very aware that a lot of people with um, bully breeds or other strong dogs for some reason think that you need to train them in a different way and that positive reinforcement or reward based training isn't going to work. For some reason people think that if you've got a strong dog you need to use a strong hand. That is just so not true. Jambo here is the first Staffordshire Bull Terrier to be a champion trick dog, he's a trick dog champion. He's also Dog of the Year for In the Dog House. He's not even two years old. How did we achieve this? Well, we achieve this with positive reinforcement training, with using rewards, not force. Um, his big sister's a beautiful German Shepherd, and she too is obviously trained force free. It's the only way to train your dog. If you start using force and aversives, yeah, I'm not saying it doesn't work. It does work. It works, but it also instill, instills fear in your dog. You don't need to be a pack leader. It's actually been proven. Wolves live in family units. So if wolves live in family units, and the leaders of the pack are simply the parents, then that is the role that you need to be taking with your dog. You don't need to be dominating your dog. None of these alpha roles or scruff shakes, no kicking, no prodding, no spraying. These are all things that are going to make your dog fearful. And we actually think that it's really, really, really important that you don't do that. Especially if you've got a strong breed. You, like, let's face it, why would you do something that one day your dog might say, I've had enough of that, and might react to your training might be the whole reason that your dog does exactly what people think those strong breeds do. Okay? So if you want your dog to be the best ambassador possible for their breed, 
knees, train, force, free. Okay, jump on. up, up. <laughs> yeah. So that's your introduction to what we're going to be doing. Yeah, it's good.